Baby. Here. Drink up. He's not picking it. Water. The water you asked for. Come on, baby. Take now. You wanted to drink water. Baby. Baby, you need to stop this. Take. What is this? My heart is broken. What have I done to deserve this? My heart is broken. I feel so terrible. Why did God let me go blind? My wedding is in a few weeks. And suddenly I went blind? Baby, you shouldn't be talking like this. You shouldn't sound this way. It's wrong. Because God did not make you blind. And have you thought of... Have you thought of people who died in the same accident you were involved in? Virtually everybody died except you. And then you went blind. You are blind but God is aware of it. God gave you life. He spared your life for a reason. And this God who spared your life, who gave you life, has a purpose for you. And I believe that purpose will come to pass one day. You just have to be hopeful. Because when there is life, there is hope. Please. Margaret, you don't understand. My life is completely useless. All my life I have been a hard-working man. I've worked hard for my money. I've traveled around the world. And suddenly, my life came to a standstill. What have I done to deserve this? My life is completely shattered. My entire existence is worthless. Baby, how can you say such a thing? What do you mean your entire existence is completely worthless? How can you say your, your life is worthless? Says who? Says who? Baby, you're beginning, to, you're beginning to sound very ungrateful to God. You are beginning to sound like an ungrateful man and that is wrong. People lost their life. A lot of people lost their life, but here you are standing. Just that you cannot see. Don't you think this same man who spared your life can also make you see? Do you think so? Margaret, my money is completely useless. I can't even see the beautiful woman I intend to get married to. Your money is not useless. Richard, your money is not useless. God blessed you. He blessed you with everything anyone can think of in this life. He gave you wealth. And then he gave you life. Have you ever imagined yourself as a poor blind man? How would you have coped? No, really, how would you have managed? But here you are at the comfort of your home. You have everything at your beck and call. You have everything anyone can ever ask for. The only thing you don't have is your sight. But that is not the worst thing that can happen to a man. The same God that made you a billionaire can, 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 can give you back your sight. Have you ever thought of that? Margaret. Promise me you won't leave me. Richie. Richard. Richard, how can you say such a thing? Yeah, you're right. What makes you think I will ever ever in my life abandon you or leave you for what just promise me i cannot promise you something that can never happen you and i know it's against my faith 
it's against my church doctrine to move in with a man who I am not married to yet. But I moved in with you, Richard. Richie, I moved in with you because I love you. I had to go against my faith because someone had to take care of you and that person is me. I am here because I love you. I am here because you are the love of my life. So there is no way I will leave you at any point or abandon you. It can never happen. Just promise. I promise. Now you promise me you will never say a thing like this again. I promise I won't. What's that? Are you okay? Oh, nothing. Just that. Uh, what happened? What do you mean? Ah, baby. Uh, what is it? Come here. It's nothing. It's nothing. It's just that it's. You it's know, what? I, 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 anytime I hug you, I feel this way. I usually. Babe, don't, don't you want me. to hug me? I'm hugging really? you. Ah, switch. <sighs> Margaret, are you okay? Mm. Are you okay? Mm. Are you okay? Mm. I'm just a um, uh, mm. I'm in the spirit. Oh, Father, Lord. You're scaring me. Uh, no, no, I'm sorry. I'm back. I'm that I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm I'm back. I'm I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. i Let's get the mosque in the yakata. Let's get the in the yakata. Let's get the mosque in the yakata. I'm in the spirit. It's a sin. She got the mosque in the yakata. 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 Babe. Yes, baby. Is that yes. you? Yes, I'm here. Are you okay? Um, I'm alright. What was that? Uh, baby, um, I think you should go in and rest, okay? Stop no, going. no, I need to know what the problem is. You scared me. Baby, there's no problem. I was just in the spirit, okay? You need to rest. Uh, you need, you, baby, you, you need to go in and rest. You, you, you didn't want me to touch or hold you? Baby, come on. You, we agreed until we we're married before we can do we can do that, you know. Maybe yeah. come on, let's let's go inside so you can rest. Uh. Yeah. Yes. Okay.
Eva, where are you? Um, baby, I'm here. I just, I... I went to pee. I went to use the restroom. Um, Eva, are you sleeping already? We've not prayed. Huh? Hold on, let's pray. We need to pray before you go to bed. Ah, uh, baby, we need to pray. Baby, we have to pray. Tina, what exactly are you talking about? The fact that you met a lady in the church is not a guarantee that she's going to be a wife material. I am a woman and I will tell you for sure, a lot of girls in the street can make a better wife material than some girls who commit abominations behind closed doors and always go hiding themselves in the church. Tina, I'm excited you said some girls. I wish they'd tell you that she's totally different. She's not some girls on the streets. You need to come to church to see how she worships God. You need to come to church to see how she uses her voice to bring down the Holy Spirit. Have you seen her pray? You need to come to church and see how she works for God. You should do that. Richard. Listen, I totally understand your point. But then you have to also realize that when it comes to taking a wife, There's one person who's always priority to every man. Tina, I have made money. By the grace of God, I'm very comfortable. I need a wife, not just a wife, a God-fearing wife. Someone who's going to back me up spiritually. Someone who's going to love me for me. Someone who's going to be prayerful. And I have found all of that in her. Don't you understand? My brother, I am not against that. Listen, you are the only brother I have. I will do everything possible to protect your interest. Our parents are no longer here. Mm. All I ask you is for you to know more about the girl you want to marry and not just jump into marriage because you see her sing in the church. Yes, there are still the good ones out there, but you need to look well before you rip. All that glitters is not good. Besides, there is nothing like true love out there. We have a lot of gold diggers out there who will do everything possible to win your heart just because you are wealthy. And when they go and get stuff, they run. My brother, like I said before, all that glitters is not gold. Tina. I'll advise you open your heart to love. Give love a chance. Find someone to love you. And trust me, you're going to come back to me and say love is a beautiful thing. Give it a try. It's very important. As for me, I'm in love with her. And she's the one I want to spend the rest of my life with. I'm very sorry if that offends you.
Sokoto, Sokoto, they make Sokoto, Sokoto. But I look for many years, many years. Yeah, beside me, love me more. What did I look for Sokoto, Sokoto, they make Sokoto, Sokoto. What did I look for many, many years, years. love me more. What did I look for many, many years, love me more. What did I look for many, many years. Babe. 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 She's a woman after my heart. I am glad. My dreams have come true. I got you, baby. You're my everything. You're my world, baby. You're my everything, baby. You're my world. What I look for, Sokoto. Sokoto. They're my Sokoto. Sokoto. What I look for, many years. Many years. They're beside me. Love me. What did I look for, Sokoto. Sokoto. They're my Sokoto. What did I look for many years? Love me more. What did I look for many years? Love me more. What did I look for many years? Love me more. Love me Is more than ruby. Oh, I have found my love. What I look for, Sokoto. Sokoto. They met Sokoto. Sokoto. What I look for, many years. Many years. They're beside me. Love me. What did I look for, Sokoto. Sokoto. They met Sokoto. Sokoto. What did I look for, many years. Love me. What did I look for, many She's a woman after my heart. I am glad my dreams have come true. True. My love is now complete. Cause I got you, baby. You're my everything. You're my world. What I look for, Sokoto. Sokoto. They met Sokoto. Sokoto. What I look for, many years. Many years. They're beside me. Love me. What did I look for, Sokoto. Sokoto. They met Sokoto. Sokoto. What did I look for, many, many years. years. Love me. What did I look for, many years. Love me. What did I look for?
Ah, you I tell you, sir, they drink kai kai. Am I high this hot afternoon? Good afternoon. Ha. Ah, yeah. now you come. So, who are you and who are you looking for? I'm the house help. I called the number I saw on the vacancy post. I was told to come today. So, who called you? Male or female? Male. I suppose you're older. Male? I suppose you're older. Are you sure you're not one of these people targeting my yoga? No. You just say you know they eye my yoga? No, no. No. Oh! Oh, yeah, wait you. No move. Are they come?
come on hi how you doing how about you hopping in let me give you a lift ah uh, hop in come on let me give you a lift oh fine boy oh <laughs> hello Hello. Ah, you didn't even look at me. How are you doing? I'm okay. I'm okay. Um, I can see you're jogging and, and the sun is too much. Come on. Yeah, as you can see. Uh, um, how about you hopping into the car? Let me give you a lift. Um, what do you think? Thanks, but no thanks. But like you say, I'm jogging under the sun. Okay. But still, still part of the exercise. Um, but not under the sun. I mean, this is a scorching sun, eh? Huh? Don't you think so? Uh, listen, listen. I know you're heading to the stadium, and that's my way. I can drop you by if you want. Huh? I can drop you off there. Come on. Huh? I mean, you are a gentleman, don't you think so? You shouldn't keep a lady waiting. Let me just drop you off at the stadium, huh? You know what? Listen, listen. Let me be truthful to you, huh? Let me be straight with you. Okay. I I like you, uh, and I believe you like me too. Or don't you? Come on. Huh? Oh shit. <laughs> well, it's it's okay. It's fine. Oh god. <laughs> it's, it's fine. It's uh -huh. fine. <laughs> domestic work at all, I can do it. Please, provided it puts food on my table. Please, sir, I need this job. What's your name again? Belinda. Oh, Belinda. Belinda. Yes. I'm happy you are ready to work. As long as it puts food on your table. It shows that you are very resilient. Thank you, sir. Keep it up. Thank you, sir. Um, you see that vacancy out there? I placed it before I lost my sight. Oh, sorry, yes. sir. Sorry. Yes. You see, I've never been the type to eat out. I like my food prepared at home. Yes, that's why I put the, the vacancy outside so I can get someone to help me do the house chores and uh, practically cook for me. But unfortunately, I have a fiancé who thinks it is inappropriate for a wife-to-be to cook for her husband-to-be. It is against her moral beliefs according to her and sometimes she hardly visits me because she thinks we're not yet married she is a very good Christian to cut a long story short she lives with me now and I don't think it would be wise for me to make a decision without her so I don't think it is nice for me to make a decision to bring you in without informing her. So I'm sorry to say that my wife is in a better position to decide if we need a maid or cook 
in this house. Chai, sir, please, please. I really need this job, please. You need to help me, please. Uh, Belinda, yes, um, I understand how you feel. But I'm very sorry to disappoint you. My wife has to be the one to decide. Different. Look? Yeah. Oh, sorry, I, I meant to say you smell nice. <laughs> oh, okay. Of course, baby, I should. I mean, since my man cannot see me, yeah. at least he should smell me. Oh. And nice. he should smell freshness out of me. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. <laughs> baby, did you eat something? Uh, I'm fine, I'm not hungry. You sure? Yes, yes, yes. Mm -hmm. hey, welcome back home. Thank you, baby. Uh, uh. And uh, who are you? Oh, so, so sorry, babe. I, I should have done that introduction a long time ago. Um, her, her name is Belinda. Uh, she's here for the job of the housemaid. Oh. Yeah, she saw the vacancy outside. But I told her I had put that a long time ago before I went blind. Yes. And I also told her that uh, my fiance is in the position to decide who becomes the maid. Mm. That I told her you are in charge. Yeah. Yes. Uh, uh, Belinda, uh, here is my fiance. Uh, she is a woman of God. She's almost like a pastor. <laughs> yes. Ma. Yeah. Please, ma. Ma, please. I, I really need this job. Please. Please, ma. You have the job already. Ah. I do? Mm -hmm. Baby, that was really fast. Thank you. Oh, Thank you. So. Baby, that was Thank fast. You. <laughs> <laughs> Thank Come you on, so much. There is, there, is, you, there is actually nothing to think about. I mean, we need her. We have a lot of chores that needs to be taken care of exactly, in this house. Exactly, exactly. And um, she's fit for the job. I like her. Oh, that's good. And if you don't mind, baby, I think she should start up today. If today? you don't mind. Of course. Uh, if she's, she's ready. too fast? Oh, come on. I mean, <laughs> she wants the job, don't you? Oh. You want the job, right? Yes, ma. Good, settled. At the end of the month, you will be paid 50,000 Naira. Is that okay by you? Yes, ma. I'm yeah. sure. I'm grateful. Thank yeah. you, ma. That's really nice. Thank you, sir. Fine, settled. You're welcome. You're welcome. <laughs> then your job starts now. Get my bag. Hmm? That's ma. really nice. Uh, I, I just wanted to get my stuff, my bag from my house. And... Yes, ma. Thank you, sir. Thank you, ma. Baby, I'm coming. Let me crush it up. All right. Once a woman, her curse is more than ruby. Oh, I have found my lover, lover. What I look for, Sokoto. Sokoto. Baby, I'm Sokoto. Sokoto. What I look for, many years. Many years. There beside me, lover. What did I look for, Sokoto? Sokoto. What did I look for, man? What did I look for, man? What did I look for, man? Love, 
She's a woman after my heart I am close My dreams have come true Have I met you before? No. No. Why do I have this... this feeling like I have... Um, I have met you somewhere outside, outside this house? No, Ma, I, I doubt. I see. So, um, what's that your name again? Belinda. Belinda? Yes. Why Belinda? Are you a snake? Oh, that's the meaning of your name. Oh, you didn't know the meaning of your name. I'm not a snake, ma. You better not be. And I hope you are not sneaky. No, ma. Because I don't like sneaky people. Hmm? You're not slimy, sneaky, me grimo. No, ma. Huh? <laughs> Come on, I'm just messing with you. I'm just joking. Thank you, ma. I see. You look good. Do you like your job? Yes, ma. Are you enjoying your job? Yeah, yes, ma. Do you like your uniform? Yeah, yes, ma. I love it, ma. I see. Oh, turn around. Hmm. You're a fine girl. Thank you, ma. Um, you know, at the end of the day, when you're done with um, your work in this place, you can change into anything. I mean, into your clothes. You know, right? Thank you. Yes, ma'am. Um, you can even wear something sexy. You know? My husband will see you, so don't bother. Because if you're planning on seducing him, uh, <laughs> he's not seeing you. Maybe the gate man will see you, okay? Hmm? Thank you. Uh, at least uh, one thing you get out of this house is uh, maybe you got a husband. Johnny might like you and you guys might, you know, match made in my husband's house. Hmm? Thank you. Breakfast is ready, I can mm. see. Yes, Good. Mm, I like you. Ah, uh, but, um, um, you should change your name you know just my honest um, suggestion hmm? good girl oh go get your boss so we can eat and get my husband um, sorry my husband to be <laughs> thank you mom.
nice, Mama. Mm -hmm. Very nice. <laughs> Hey. Sorry, sorry, my dear. <coughs> mm -hmm. Please go. Ma? When last did you speak with your cousin's sister? Hmm. Mama, she, she called yesterday and she said she would call today, but she's here to call. Yesterday, Nka? Mm -hmm. Ah. Um, did she finally secure the job she thought about? Mama, she said... <laughs> okay, speak of oh. the devil. She... Is she the one calling? Yes. <laughs> hey. Hello, hello sister. I'm fine, I'm fine. And you? Is there any good news? Of course there is good news. Wow! Oh my god! Sister, I'm so happy for you. <laughs> Thank you. I'm so happy for you. Um, how is Mama? Uh, Mama is fine. Mama is fine. Mama is great, you know. Oh, okay. I'm sorry I couldn't call yesterday. I wasn't having enough call card. But don't worry, I'll still call you guys later, okay? Okay. Sister, bye bye. My regards to Mama. Okay, I have to go now. Bye. Yes, me now, let me speak with her no, now. No, 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 Mama, she said she'll come back later. <laughs> Finally! I'm so happy hey, for her. I'm my so happy. Daughter. Yeah, you should be happy for her. You should be happy for your sister now. Yes, Mama, eh? I'm so happy hey. for her. Hey! Mwah, mwah, mwah. Hey. I'm so happy, yo. <laughs> Finally. So oh. thank you for the job. Thank God, yo. God, I bless your name. I know that my God will do it for me. Yes, He's yes. going to do it for me. Yes, my My God will answer my prayer. Yes. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Hey, um, take it easy now. Ma? I, I, I watch a go for mm -hmm. Hey, you eat. Uh-uh. Uh -uh. Eat food. Uh, Mama needs now. Eat food. I have found my lover, lover. What I look for, Sokoto. Sokoto. Very much, Sokoto. Baby, your friend Ben is here. Oh, Ben Chile, Richard. How are you? I'm good, bro. Hey, welcome. <laughs> Please have a seat, have a seat, have a Thank seat. Thank you, good to see you, bro. Good to see you too, my brother. Babes, he didn't tell me he would be coming. Should have uh, prepared something for him. Oh. I mean, we just finished eating breakfast. Oh, I'm, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. Um, ben had called me um, a few days ago and promised to visit. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry I didn't tell you. It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. Uh, yeah, yeah. Please kindly make something for him to eat. Yeah, yes, yes. Ben, you're welcome. Please make yourself comfortable. Uh, babe, uh, uh, Ben uh, is here uh, to help with the wedding plans. Oh, really? Oh, yes, yes, yes. Remember the five million I promised to give you? Yes. He's going to make sure of that. Oh. He'll, he, the, the money will hit your account. Thank you so much, babe. You're welcome. You're welcome. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> Thank you, Ben. Thank you for volunteering yeah, to yes, help us. Yeah, yeah. Thank you so much. Yeah. Babe, go make something for him to eat, okay? Um, Ben, so what do I offer you? Anything for this home is good. <laughs> <laughs> um, let me offer you something. Huh? Let me get you a drink and I prepare something for you. Yeah, before you go, uh, you see, Ben is my good friend. Uh, he's like a brother to me. So I want you to trust him. Okay? I know I have lost my sight, but with him, I can see clearly. <laughs> <laughs> yes. That's true. All right. Thank you, Ben. Yeah, Thank yeah. In addition to that, you see this particular wedding that I'm planning myself, personally, right. it's going to be the talk of the town. Oh, yeah. The best. <laughs> I know what you can do. Yeah, of course. Oh, <laughs> Thank you very much, Ben. Thank I trust you. So you. Much. I trust you. you. Uh, babe, quickly get something for him to eat. Okay, Ben, let me get you something. Huh? It's Welcome. Okay. <sighs> ben, Richie. what's up with you? How are you doing? I'm good, bro. Wow, happy to see you, man. You see, I forgot to tell my wife that, uh, or my wife to be, that uh, you called and uh, you promised to come around. But 
I totally forgot to tell you. You are still you, always. <laughs> you always forget. I will say something and I will do this while you still forget. I know you. But it's okay. You're welcome. <laughs> Thank you, brother. Please Thank make you. yourself comfortable. Uh, she'll be here shortly, yeah? All right. <laughs> All right. Father, we thank you for your grace upon our life. We thank you for all you have done. We thank you for your mighty power over our lives. Daddy, we say may your name alone be glorified in Jesus' name. Father, I thank you for my husband-to-be. I thank you for Richard. I thank you for I know you will give him a sight back in no due time. That in no due time, O oh Lord, you will restore his sight. We are expecting a miracle. Father, I cover my household with the blood of Jesus Christ. I cover this house with the blood of Jesus Christ. Father, any power that is fighting against our marriage, Father, I come against it with the blood of Jesus Christ. I come against it with the blood of Jesus Christ. I release the fire of the Holy Ghost, 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 the the Holy Ghost against every manipulation, against every, every demonic powers, every demonic entity. Fire! of the Holy Ghost. Yaka de de bo si de yaka. Le ke de bo shaka de 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 skika yaka na taba. Le ke ke shika yaka na bo sheke de 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 bo si de yaka na taba. Can I hear you again? What did you just say? Ha! Who is this one again? Who called you? Did you just insult my mother? Uh huh. If I did, what would happen? Hey, Jesus! Is your mother not old? She should respect herself! Ah! Oh, no. did, you just, did you just slap me? And I will hey! slap you again! Your mother should tell this girl I'm a mad friend! I will beat you! I will scatter you! You want to fight? Yes! I will You want to fight, right? Thank you. Thank you. Stop. Come on, wake up. 
baby, stop. Come here, come close to me. Baby, we can't do this. We Hold can't. on, I, I, I miss you. I, I need know, you right and now. I miss you too, but we cannot do this. We can't. Oh, oh, what do you mean we can't? Remember, we had an agreement. Oh, come on, come on. Baby, Don't say that. Come on. We had an agreement. Listen We're to not me. doing this till we get married. You've been waiting and we're almost there. Why are you punishing me? Baby, Come. I am not. Do you think listen. I don't want you as much as you want me? Uh, listen, I, can we just, just try it for uh, just Baby, a, just we cannot. Little... Baby, stop now. We wait, stop, like... we're almost there. Baby, stop. Don't hold start on. what you cannot finish. Hold Baby, stop. Come on. Baby, please, don't start. Wait. Don't stop. Ah, Baby, stop. Babe, where are you? Where are you? Can you can you can you can you stop screaming? I'm not, I'm just I'm just I'm just like I'm not scared, dude. What? Ah! Ah! Where am I? I'm in my house, of course. Please, please, I need you to come. I need you to come, oh, Jimo. Hey, every boy. No, 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 number three, Morgan Street. Morgan, Morgan, yes, Morgan. Morgan, close. Yes, number three. I'm sorry, I can't come out this late already. What? Please, now, come, come, come. I, I, I will. I will do something, I will compensate you. I will compensate you, I will compensate you. No, please, good night. Come on. Hey, hello, hello, hello. You oh, have no one me. to play. If I join you, marry money, baby. In a book, we are. Cut off you. You have to be a depends. Believe me, this is karma working on you. If he met a woman, stop crying. Oh my God, public assault. You have disgraced yourself. Baby, is that you? Yes, baby, it's me. What happened? I'm uh, nothing. I just nothing. I'm 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 just. I... Why are you sounding so strange? Is everything okay? Did I do something wrong? Ah, uh, every... Wait. Everything is fine. Everything is fine. Do we need to go to the hospital? For what? Maybe I'm just... I'm good. I'm just um. I am just uh, you, you I... sound like you're in pain. Are you in pain? Pain? No. I just went down to, you know, ask God for forgiveness. I don't understand. What? You are, what? Oh. Ah. Oh. Are I, 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 baby, don't come. Don't, 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 don't come no, close. Listen, I just, I just I, I, am not, I am not coming close to oh. you, all right? I'm not, I'm no longer in the mood. I don't want to have sex. I'm just trying to ensure that you are fine. I'm fine. Huh? I am all right. 
I just um, went down to beg God. Oh, fuck, baby, come on, don't, don't, don't come. I'm close. I'm. Oh, Jesus, Jesus. Oh, God Almighty. Father, Father. Where? What is wrong? What is it? What is it? I'm fine. No. Oh, if you don't come close, maybe I said, Joe, just go to bed, just go to bed. Come, let me put you to bed. You're getting me confused. <laughs> oh, just, 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 just. Evil has cut off you. Have to be a depends. Believe me, this is karma working on you. Why are you doing this to yourself? Why are you doing this to this man? A man that picked you up as nothing, as a nobody, trying to make you somebody. Why have you refused to give him this thing? Who is your husband to be? So then are you the one asking this question? Why have I refused to give it to him? Babes, you don't forget so I tell this man, say I be virgin. Did you forget the fact that I told him I am a virgin? Do you know what he would see when he enters there? He would swim. Babes, everywhere is open. If he enters inside here, he's going to be swimming. <laughs> everywhere in the express. So you asking me this question now is making me wonder if you've, if you've been the one I've been telling my story. You know everything now, babes. Babes, he cannot. I can't do anything. I can't give it to him now. Ha. Come up with Margaret. You of all people should be wiser than this. I mean, you know there are soaps that you use to wash your thing, to make it tighter. Mm. In fact, very tight. Babes, I have been using it. Why do you think all these boys are hovering around me? This is, it's because this place is tight. As a matter of fact, very tight. I use it all the time. But that is not the problem. But the problem is, as I use and they knock, it they lose. I did knock, it did lose. I did knock, it did lose. I did knock, it did lose. Now I've thrown out now, now, now something with this now. It could lose now. Okay, let's assume I use the almighty Obunga one and then it tightens. The guy enters there and after doing it, no blood. Blood is supposed to come out now. As a Virginia, blood is supposed to come out. And babes, I am not ready to risk it. Because you know, one of the things that is still keeping this guy with me is the fact that I am virgin. He likes virgins. In fact, looking at me every day, he sees me as that untapped, fresh, you know, Odala that is going to, you know, suckle on very soon. And when he goes there and finds out that Naboho <laughs> Dedie, my sister, Church Abwasa, everybody are now. Virginia, Iko, yeah. Excuse you. Eh, 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 babes, I hope you are not, you are not mocking me. I hope that is not mock I smelt now. No, I'm not mocking you, my dear friend. Listen, the worst thing that can happen to oneself is to lie to others and still lie to him or herself. Margaret, you are still going to get married to this man, which means you are still going to have sex with him, oh? Um, Susan, Susan, I beg. Just, just let it be. When we get to that bridge, we will cross it. So my darling Susie, as long as you're concerned, as long as I'm concerned, I am a virgin. Nim, kankorobowa. Let me knock, oh, let me knock before you go late. When we get to that bridge. Obia, 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 Obia. Get one of those boys to help me. Go, 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 go. Are you still here? Get oh, down! Oh, great! Get down now! Oh. Oh. Get down, get out! Ah. Oh. Close my door! Close my door! If he met you, 
Stop crying I'm begging Public assault You have disgraced Yourself trying to call you, but you were not waking up. Are you fine? I'm fine. Are you sure? And your wife to be, how is she? She's okay. I will branch to your house later in the day to see you. It's fine. Are you sure about this? I said I'm fine. I should not come. Alright, fine. Take care of yourself. Sure, fine. I look for Sokoto, Sokoto, they match Sokoto, Sokoto, what I look for many years, many years, they're beside me, love me more, what I look for Sokoto, Sokoto, they match Sokoto, Sokoto, what I look for many years, love me more, what I look for many years, love me more, Miss Smith, please, it's your madam. Yeah. Who are you? And who are you looking for? Like I said, I'm Smith by name. I came to see your madam. My madam that way say they come? Yes, of course, she's away, like I said. You sure? Yes. Yeah. I have 
find my lover, lover boy. What I look for, Sokoto. Sokoto. They met Sokoto. Sokoto. What I look for, many years. What am I doing here? I for real? What do you mean, what am I doing here? Were you not the one that called me yesterday night? That I should bring down your voice. I'm saying that I should come over, that you need me right away. Besides, you mentioned the address. Well, yesterday. That was when I called you, not today. Yesterday and today, they are not the same thing. Well, I called you yesterday when I was honey. But you disappointed me as usual. Really? Because it was already late. That's why I'm here mm -hmm. to make it up to you. I hear you. You understand? I'm here to make it up to you. But wait, you never told me that you were married. Says who? Yeah, you never told me. And who said I am married? God. Oh. <laughs> you mean the blind bat you saw outside? Really? Well, that is somebody I am just, um, I'm just managing. Managing? Mm-hmm. I mean, the guy, the guy has money. Look around you. He's the owner of the house. I am just putting up with him, managing him for the meantime. Meanwhile, why didn't you act along when I asked you if you came with your tools? You should have just said yes. The guy is blind. He cannot see. He does not know if you came with your tools or not. Speaking of tools, anyway, you... You came with the tool. Fine, boy. Ignore me. The guy is my fiancé. Your fiancé? Mm -hmm. No, I think I have to leave now. Go away. My friend, go back. Mm. You think I'll let you go with this gorgeous self of yours? What are you doing? Guy, park now. What are you doing? Uh, you don't come, be say you don't come. You go collect thanks for coming. Really? Yeah. Don't you like the small, small tips I give you when you give it to me the way I like it? Are you, are you uh, sure about this? Very sure. You know what? On a second thought, we have plenty of rooms in this place. Yeah? The house is big. We just go into one of the rooms and I'll uh, put on the TV, increase the volume. You know, I like to shout. Huh? So that when we're doing it, nobody will hear us. Ah, you know, I like it. Ah! What, mm. what, what, is, what is it? Oh, fine boy. <laughs> you came out the right time. Get it I won't work so good. I won't be such a boom, Maggie. Such a boom, Maggie. You know, ordinarily, I should have sent you back in. Or make sure you are nowhere around this vicinity. But I am not that kind of person. Sweetheart. I am a good woman. I am a very nice woman. Hmm? 
You know what? As a matter of fact, how much is your salary again? 50,000 euro. At the end of this month, I will pay you the sum of 100,000 Naira. You shouldn't be shocked. You deserve it. Thank you, Mom. You're very hardworking. And I need you. Hmm? You're very useful to me. You see, my darling, the things you do in this house, I cannot do them. Especially the food aspects. I can't even cook to save my life. Hmm? So I will be needing you. And my husband. He likes you. He has accepted you. So you see, I need you. And if you continue like this, if you continue being hardworking and smart, I promise there will be continuous increment in your salary. You like that, right? Thank you, Mom. You like it, right? So all you need to do is keep being smart and hard working. Hmm? You can do that, right? Hmm? Yes, ma'am. Good girl. One more thing. What you saw earlier today, if you ever tell it to a soul, consider yourself dead. Do we have a deal? Do we have a deal? Yes, ma'am. Good girl. Come. What you need is the reverence. Do I bite? Do I bite? <laughs> Come on. Come. A little closer.
ça. Ça. Yeah, who's that? Belinda, ça. Oh. Belinda, are you okay? Yes, sir. Oh, sorry, I, I dozed off. So, madame is not back. I was waiting to give her the list of things she asked for. So I can go to bed. Oh, yes. Uh, she's not back. Uh, she went to church, actually. She has gone to pray. They're going to the mountain to pray for us. And she said she'll be spending a couple of days. So she's not coming back. Yeah. Oh. So is Madame really a woman of God, like you said? Yes. She is. <laughs> um, Belinda, yes, sit down. Belinda. Sir. I think I like the question you asked me. I met my fiancé in church. I had gone to church to seek the face of God after living a reckless life. I wanted to get back to God. My first day in church, I met her. She took all my attention away. The way she sang, the way she spoke in tongues, the way she prayed, I said to myself, this is all I need in a woman. Belinda, I am a very hardworking man. I have worked hard enough to make myself comfortable as a man. But there's something missing. I've always wanted a woman who would take me close to God. A woman to support me with her prayers. And all of that I have found in Margaret. We promised each other to love ourselves forever. And trust me, my present predicament, I mean the incident that happened to me, I see it as an obstacle. I feel like it was sent from the devil to discourage her. But something tells me God allowed it to happen so we can test her faith. I needed to know if she would love me for me and trust me, I'm very excited. It is very, very difficult to find a woman who would end up with a blind man like me. Belinda, I'm very excited to say that I made the right choice. Margaret has been my best friend. She has promised to stay beside me. She has promised to love me forever. And I've seen just that. Something tells me I'm going to be the happiest man on earth because we're getting married very soon. And I strongly believe I have made the right choice. Don't you think so? Belinda, don't you think I made the right choice? Of course. <laughs> yes, sir. Uh, you're, you're a lucky man. Oh yes, indeed, I'm a lucky man. Belinda, you can go to bed. She, she's not coming home tonight. Okay, sir. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. What I look for, Sokoto. Sokoto. Very much, Sokoto. Sokoto. What I look for, many years. Many years. Girl beside me, love more. What did I look for, Sokoto. Sokoto. What did I look for, man? What did I look for, man? What did I look for, man? Love 
She's a woman after. Glenn. Hey, what's up, Ben? How far? You good? Yeah, yeah, I'm cool. So what's up? What's the situation about my fiance? You know, I followed her to the church and um, as I speak with you right now, I am seated inside my car while she's inside the church. And um, tomorrow I will still follow her, you know, but so far so good. She's clean. Trust me. Oh, great. I'm excited to hear this. Yeah. Come on, bro. You know, I can actually do this thing for just one person. And that one person is you. You see? I got your back, bro. You've got nothing to worry about. Listen, I just want to thank you for everything, yeah? I want to appreciate you for being such a, a wonderful friend and brother. I know I am blind, but with you, I don't feel blind, yeah? You're welcome, bro. Okay, I'll talk to you later, all right? All right. Thank you. Thanks a lot. Talk to you later. Yeah, bye. Right. Hey sis, what's up? Yeah, yeah, I'm good. So listen, I I'm ready to go ahead with the wedding plans. The information I'm getting about my fiance is good. So I'm ready to go on this journey with her. I'm ready to walk down the aisle with her, yes. Yes, babe. I'm coming. I can't wait. Hurry up. I know you can't wait to have more of me. Right? I was born in the street. Lost my parents at a very tender age. And since then, life became so unfair. It was from one scale of hardship to another. No one cared to help if there is nothing to gain in return. And so, until I went into the streets, but, but not because I liked it, but because of hardship. Because that was the only thing that came into my mind. Because of pressure. Yes, I slept with men for money. And I am not proud of it. Belinda. Sir. That's a very pathetic story. I'm very sorry to hear. And I do not want to sound judgmental. But aren't you worried about how people would see you when you tell them these?